I'm calling race four the feature tonight. It's an other than allowance race for fillies and mares, throwing up going five ace on grass with the rails at 17 feet. The one beam pot could very well be the filly to beat third off a layoff, getting a bit more rest here than she's had previously. She cuts back to a wind distance of five furlongs. She's a very good gate horse. She has sharp early speed. The one post and all those attributes are a strong combination the way this course has been playing. The rallying runner-up in her pace collapsing last took a much richer optional other than allowance race at Woodbine last Saturday. So she has form, speed, and company lines. Number five, Rosadada is an improving four-year-old who gives weight to all and significant weight even at this distance to some very sharp three-year-olds. The pace scenario here will be tougher for her than in her first two races, but she has upside and could sit a trip if someone else takes on the one bean pot. If Rosadita has to take on bean pot, I don't like Rosadita, but if someone else really can entertain the horse on the rail, then Rosadita has a real live shot to move forward. But the horse I'm picking is the two Laconia, who has thrived with a steady campaign this season. She's gotten better and better with racing. Two back, she was hard used and was the best finishing pace horse by far off a 48-day respite. I like her better off quicker turnarounds. Last time out, she put away a very sharp paced foe and held decisively. She looked physically resplendent. I think she's absolutely blossoming in the autumn, and her versatility is a big plus in race four. My selections, two, five, and one.